It's John, aka Smelly Telly, and I'm hanging out here in Evansville, Indiana at More Music and MoreGuitars.com. And today I'm picking on this Golden Fifth Avenue Kingpin P90. It's a lot of P's in the Kingpin P90. So um, I picked it up, and the first thing I did is I put it in open D tuning and started playing kind of swampy stuff on it the best I can. That's what the guitar pulled out of me, so I'm sure that probably other people will play, you can play jazz on it, rockabilly, things like that. I'm sure it's awesome. It's just what, for some reason, that's what I gravitated to. So I'm going to leave it in open D for the rest of the demo, too. So let's talk about the specs. Uh, tuners are geared ratios, so you have like 18 to 1 with your wound strings and 26 to 1 on the uh, strings 1, 2, and 3, basically, or 1, 2, 3, and 4, maybe. And it is a Canadian wild cherry wood throughout the fretboard is rosewood. And you have, of course, the floating bridge down here. You know, it's, a, it's an arch top. And then the P90. So just like not a lot of features, right? It's a single pickup guitar, P90. And it definitely uh, kind of takes you to a certain place in time, right? You're looking at it. And I'm looking at this and I'm thinking like, well, if it was a little bit more beat up, maybe somewhere in the 1920s or 30s, you know, play it. Some dude in the corner just playing, trying to make some tips so he can just get some drinking money, that kind of thing. So it's a pretty cool vibe. Um, and I love the way it looks, actually. I think it looks really cool. Let's get a couple of more sounds out of it. We've got it plugged into the Mesa Boogie uh, Fillmore. And we've got it kind of set clean with a little bit of reverb. Um, like I said, I'll, I'm going to leave it in open E just because I think it's cool. And just so you can see the volume works. And the tone. pretty cool so one thing for me I actually I've had a I've owned a seagull so same company basically I've owned a seagull s6 I think is one of the first batches that came in at more way back in the 
very late 90s or early 2000s. So the neck actually feels very familiar to me. In fact, the overall kind of aesthetic of it reminds me a lot of that, that S6. So I feel pretty at home with this guitar, actually pretty surprisingly, <laughs> as a matter of fact. I actually, I dig this. I could see where it is kind of wouldn't appeal to a certain type of player, but I actually really, really do dig this. And I'll tell you another little thing. The price ain't too bad either. <laughs> so, not super loud acoustically. You know, I don't have it turned up. If you banged on it really hard and someone was standing close to you, they'd be able to hear it. But, you know, you're not going to take this to a, like a bluegrass competition or anything like that. So, Cool guitar. If you have any questions about it, this is, by the way, again, the Golden Fifth Avenue Kingpin P90. And if you got any questions about it, of course, you can call down here at More Music or you can get on our website at moreguitars.com. Our sales associates will get right back with you pretty fast and get you all set up and on your way. Um, my name is John. You can call me Smelly. Thanks for hanging out, and I'll see you in the next video.